blowing. Yeah. yeah, I am gonna fail at blowing this thing off because it took me 15 minutes to blow up a dolphin. And not Tim is probably gonna beat me. And not this dolphin. The smaller question is this. Yes, I'm going up against the scuba diver. It's Jack Cousteau's long lost brother Tim. I'm not doing anything. Oh, 
Sand raus und nachher Come on. Yes, finally. <sighs> if I lose to Tim now, Come on! Come on! I know it's all scary on camera, but whatever. Oh, for fuck's sake! I'm beating Tim. Okay. Good. Is that done? Okay. Huh? Yes. Almost. I'm going to stop. Now. Now. No, 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 no. I've beat Tim! I'm the best. Don't cheat me. Hang on, I wasn't cheating. Since when did it say in the rules which we didn't set out that I couldn't use their pump that was provided? Which was standing right there not being used and begging to be used for blowing up the balloon. <laughs> Beach ball. Well, you can use it for a room. Huh? If I was going to give you a pump, I would have given it to you in the first place, Jason. And you did. It was left right there and it said, Chester, Chester, please use me. I can help you inflate the beach ball faster. It would be oh. funny if I left it on deflate and you tried to inflate it and it's still in deflate setting. See? This is a big hole. Oh. I wonder if I can... Bounce on top of it. Don't break it. Yeah, I know, I won't be able to. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come Not just that valve, but we also have two other valves that have been in this common small edition, but they get doesn't have these. One larger version of
summer, man. Oh, so it's cold. Come on, so close. And now to do my left of the hole. Yeah. so they can see you. Hmm? Because I'm used to 25 litre pools now, this will seem short. Listen. Yeah? Because I'm used to 25 yeah. litre pools, this will seem short. How difficult it is, I'm trying to throw it to myself while I'm talking on the camera. Right, it is. Missed again. Thank you. 
depths of the, this is Jacques Cousteau, Chester Cousteau, and saying, underneath the pool, I mean, in the, underneath the water in the pool. Yes, I can. I'm almost on my face. I think that. Yeah, that means it's the camera suit again. Yeah. Let's watch the video. Oh, hang on, I'm making it there. Comically making it there. Oh! Same your camera towels in the way, but oh! Alright, <laughs> comically making it there. Three, two, one, two. Yes, flip. Oh. And swing. And flip. Yeah. Camera. Oh. Let's see how much of it I got. Wait. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just I gently put it on the bottom, don't. Huh? Gently put it on the bottom before then slam it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because theoretically it shouldn't work. Underwater, the buns should work underwater. Yeah. The, oh, no. the water pressure. Okay, that, that's weird. Thank you. 
I'm going to try to be upside down. And I'm turning down. Oh, come on. Is it possible to get dizzy from turning in the wall? I'm about to find out. Actually, I'll go introduce myself for this, Tim. I'm a new scientific explorer. A person thing who experiments. Is it possible to get dizzy from spinning around in the water? I'm going to find out. Bear with me. I don't want to be attacked by the killer dog. Ready? Getting dizzy. Let's do this. Alright, I begin by lying down on top of the ball and dusty and straighten my legs hopefully and spin, 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 on so down to spin, and spin, on so spin, oh crap, spin, ah, spin, oh, I have to go the other way because so I'm going to go civil. Hang on. Oh. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. I'm actually getting dizzy. Alright, oh, because you can't fall over in water. It is possible to get dizzy. It is actually possible to get dizzy when spinning around in water. Wow, that should have really freaked my head out. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Whilst I go and vomit now. Got it that time. Wow, are you serious? I just want to sound so 
this has to be the most stupid thing written, I know you can't see it, but stupid thing written on a flotation device or whatever. It says, flotation toy warning, use only under com competent supervision, do not leave children unattended while devices in use. Well, first of all, it's not a device because there's no electrics in it. And if there was, I don't think you'd want to get it anywhere near the water, let alone with children near the water. Second of all, what on earth is a child going to do with this that's going to become of any harm to them? Other than the obvious eating, but by the time they get to use these under no supervision, they should know why not to eat it. But still, what are they going to do? Hit someone over the head like that? That doesn't hurt, does it? If they're deep into a pool, they might fall off it. Well, they'd know not to go into the deep end, wouldn't they? Oh, the thing's so soft, it can be bent like this, for God's sake. Stop! <coughs> Stop! Ten move. Ten move. <laughs> See, it's so soft, it can be bent like this. <coughs> Look! And even that doesn't hurt. Okay, look. <coughs> soft foam. You have a hole in the middle of it, for God's sake. Oh, that's right, of course. It can be used as a deadly device for shooting water at people like this. I forgot how dangerous that is. And the bubbles, of course, on the water. And, and when you get water in it, of course, this is incredibly dangerous, isn't it, Tim? Oh no! Ow! I got hit by water! Okay, look. Well, this is so, so harmless. Okay, look, they can't even strength. Look, look, because it's so soft. Watch. Oh wait, that hurts. That hurts. <laughs> okay. I'll take that what I've said before. It is dangerous if they know how to strangle someone. Other than that, it's not dangerous. And what's this say on this big beach ball there? Oh. Okay. Warning, use only under competent supervision again. Attention at... Oh wait, that's in French. Okay, that's all it says. Use only under competent supervision. Well, what the hell does that mean? This is all ones. Does that mean if children are playing with it, the parent has to be careful? That one child's going to do this to the other child. Are you in the camera frame? Yes, you are. Stay where you are. Is it? Does that mean? Come this way a bit. Does that mean that the child's going to do this to the other child? Oh, ha, ha, ha! That hurts. Because it doesn't, does it? Okay, it does not hurt. And they can't exactly swallow this, can they? I mean, have you seen the size of it? I doubt, I doubt the BFG can even swallow it. And now I have to get to the dolphin. This is the most ridiculous one, right? Okay, this dolphin, as fun as it may look, and as amazing and awesome as it may look, it has a list of warnings on it the size of half of its fucking body. Better control the languages. Yeah, but still. How many different languages does it need? The other one says more. And the only thing it says in English... For Australia. And, and the most stupid thing of it, I don't know if you can see it, but... If you can look carefully on the thing... You're too high. Can you see it? You've got to turn, turn it round. Huh? Turn it a bit clockwise. There? Yeah, I can probably. I don't know if you can see it, but if you look, there are three sets of instructions in English. Yeah. Australian, US, and English. British English. 
what the fuck? They all speak the same language. Is it meant to be read like, warning mate, aquatic toy, you have only under supervision. That's funny, that's the only line it has in Australian English, whereas the US is, warning, this is a life-saving device, do not leave a child unattended while the device is in use. <laughs> swearing so that Sorry. Be... No. My bad. Keep away from fire, never allow diving into this product, never leave in or near the water when not in use. Follow these rules to avoid drowning, paralysis or other serious injury. How on earth? How on earth? And English of course, British English. Warning, only to be used in water in which the child is within depth within its depth and under supervision, keep away from fire. You notice how the Americans have to do a whole paragraph just to say to keep away from it, whereas Australians go with one line and English go with two? That's Americans for you. And then you've got another rambling of different... And then obviously you've got the whole thing, but again, how is it dangerous? How? I mean, there's obviously got not going to be a fire in a pool, is there? So how is it going to be... Why do you need to say keep away from fire? Rules to avoid drowning. Well, it's a flotation device to stop people from drowning, so... <laughs> what else have we got here? Only to be used in water. No, of course. It's meant to be used on dry land all of a sudden. Come on. And... It's ridiculous. Never allow diving into this product. Well, who would? It's going to hurt, isn't it? And honestly, never leave in or near the water when not in use. What's that got to do with warning? You're not, what, you're forbidden to leave if in, if in its natural habitat environment or water when you're not using it. So that kind of goes back to all, but only using water. Why, why is it telling you all the warning signs never to keep it in water when it's not in use? This is messed up. Yeah, that just about clears it for all the I'll wait for the pump. I won't do the pump because of course it's not a toy, is it? It's not a pool toy anyway, at least. I mean, there's pumps which are toys, but not pool toys. And not pumps you use to pump up stuff like this. And this ball has no warnings on it. So the only toy which has no warnings on it is a tiny little basket ball, which Again, like all of them isn't going to really cause any threat to anyone, isn't it? Is it so? Well, I know a lot of people will read to see this on YouTube and go, wait a minute, Chester, you're wrong. Every company needs that warning. And yes, that's true, but not the length of a paragraph explaining to use it in water and keep away from fire. I mean, I don't know in the Australian government or any world government if there's a subsection to all toys all poor toys or toys must be equipped with war pointless warning and with warning descriptions that are, if you read them in the right context, completely pointless. I mean, for, for one, they might as well just tell you how to pump the thing up if they want. What is that? In short, Sometimes warning labels can be a bit, bit, bit over the top. Leaders have a good brand on that. Hope you enjoyed your new year. Goodbye. Oh crap, bro. <laughs> the fence decided to not work. I think I recorded, but I kept on stopping, stopping the recording. So that might be able to retreat, retreat it later.
know if it's going to be dangerous. I don't know. Okay. He did push the person away. He really is going to sort of make the play up. This is more unstable than the two versions. And to be honest, they claim this is a weapon or bad and violent use if you throw it at someone, but come on, it's hilarious. Watch. Hopefully, I don't miss. It's hilarious, watch. Ha 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 ha, when you do fall off, so we'll be quiet so that we Thank you, Luther. We'll have that camera even there, right here. Oh. Huh. Chester? Yeah? You have to look at the camera and see where I am. Right mm -hmm. No, no, I was going to see where you were on the camera. James was with us today. Yeah. What's the time? And uh, the phone's the phone today, of course. Isn't the time on the camera? Yeah. No. I think it only shows the remaining time oh. when it's not recording. I have warnings on it. It says caution, arrow, you send me, that's it. Alright, so wait, this just says adult use only, it doesn't act. Alright, I've got a pack up on it. So, after all those pull toys, this one, the pump, which has got a sharp spike even attached to it and really hurts when you hit it on your head or whatever. The only warning sign in English, therefore the same in every language, is caution adult use only. So after loads of warnings on the pool toys not to throw it at anyone or whatever, it only says adult use only on the pump. So there's no warning that. There's no warning saying, warning, do not throw at people. Do not keep near fire. Use only in the right circumstance. No, it's just adult use only. There's no... Caution, don't stab people with pump end. There's just adult use of it. Oh, <laughs> 
new form of cricket. Ready? Yeah. It's ready with you. Come on. Bad. Okay. I'm the bowler. Yeah, you're the bowler. Oh god, he's got me the run. Oh, he's caught out. Yeah, you have to be caught in the pool. Go back a bit. You have to be caught in the pool there, it's in the brain. Changes in the it's baseball. I 
hit it so hard. It broke. Yeah. It's a new version of Catch where Tim has to catch the ball while driving on the dolphin.
Yeah, that's one way to get off. That's one way to get off. Thank you. 